Hi everyone and welcome back. In today's video, I want to show you how to make this beautiful parallax effect for presentation or landing page. Let's get started. So to begin, let's go and download the exercise file for this tutorial. You can find it in the description of this video and let's open it in Figma. So here we have our assets. So as you can see, it's a simple presentation page that we're gonna animate and create our parallax effect. So first let's go and hit command C, create a new page and command V to past. I would like to rename my page, zoom in and let's go and hit command C, command V to duplicate. All right. So for this one, I would like to, you know, let's move this one to the right. And let's go and unclip content so you can see what I am doing. Move this to the bottom this card to the bottom like that and this to the left and also all this to the bottom and my typography to the bottom all right now once I will create once I will um, I mean hit this uh, button I will have a scroll effect of this part all right to the top and this will grow until it fill all the screen so the first one we're gonna do is let's move keep the bottom here move this to the top until it disappear that's the first thing and clip content and let's go and move this also excuse me the text more to the top and this let's hit the k key and let's grow this donut like that all right and then let's move all this here move that down let's keep this ring to the front let's move this a bit down all right you like that now let's go and select my screen to frame clip content and now let me show you how it work it looks a bit chaotic but let's crop this let's crop it right here move this like that and also let's crop this until clip content and let's move this this Excuse me, so man, let's move this to the top. All right. Now for our animation, it's gonna be super simple. Let's select this button, connect it with this screen. On click, smart animate, and gentle. Let's 
for the animation time 205,000 or 2500 this being 2.5 second all right now let's go and hit flow and let's see our first scroll effect so if I click all right it work let's see again click all right now we have this problem let's go back for that so this get out of our frame let's move it back to our screen all right let's go see again all right it works great but maybe as you can see 100 percent yeah so you can see the full thing let's step the size preview to actual size all right now let's go and duplicate this command c and command v and let's hit clip content and let's move this down for this one let's create some now i can put this to zero opacity so it won't bother us and let's move all this to the top all right and you can also dissolve it to create a nice animation of element moving up and dissolving all right and now let's move this to the top like that and I will also rotate this 180 degree or 90 degree all right so it will you know it will be directed to the top and let's go and select my screen and clip content and crop it again all right but now for this i need this to be you know to to create some smooth animation this is so static need this that in the previous screen will be dissolved then it will group around this so to do that let's go and anchor up here and let's go and move this around like that move this to the top this like that all right let's crop again it's a pretty simple effect to make I think all right let's move clean click on those two move them to the top now let's go to prototype and connect screen 2 to screen 3 
or maybe excuse me my bad let's select this button and connect it on click smart animate keep the same configuration as the first screen and for this one let's connect it with the first screen so we'll go back to the first screen when we are on the bottom of the page now let's go to play and let's select all right click again and let's go back to the first screen and we have a nice and smooth presentation animation or a parallax scroll all right so as you can see we did begin from something like that and we end up with those through three screens and this amazing animation all right thank you for watching this video until the end i really appreciate it you can hit the like and subscribe button if you like this video and i hope i can see you in another tutorial